Can you please just come down for tea? Yeah, sure. Um, I'll just be a couple of minutes. I'm just doing a bit of homework. I'm just finishing it off, yeah? Right. Okay, I'll see you in a minute. If you're not going to talk to me, then I'm going. Megan! Oh. You alright, Megan? Yeah, I'm alright. Just this little bendy and all I want to say so I'm alright. You mean the gay one? He's <laughs> put naked pictures of himself on that website. Yeah, that one. Ew. Okay. It's only gay people anyway. Well, this is my boyfriend, anyway. Right? Nice to meet you, Mikey. Yeah, me too. At this World War party, I was miles smashed. Mikey here looked at me. He's so much older than me. Oh, that's cool. It was like amazing. It was love at first sight, wasn't it, babe? Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, that's so good. And he has his own car, his own job. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. I was uh, I was actually talking to someone the other day. It's just amazing. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I've got a lot of I've got to go now. I'll catch you later. Alright. Bye, Meg. Excuse me, do you have light? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't have a flag. Ah, uh, <laughs> I like it. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, what's your name? I'm Megan. Ah, I'm uh, Charlie. Nice to meet you. Yeah, but um, I've got to go now. Yeah. yeah. Um, I'll see you. Mm, come on, just chill a bit with us. Come on, you are going to have a lot of fun. All right. So, guys, let me introduce you. This is uh, Megan. Hi. This is my friends. My eyes are wide open. Been a dick, lost my discount token. No joke, have to pay for whack room too much dough, but none will go back. And my lack of sleep is creeping in. I'm deepening into my life. Megan, try this. Are you sure? Yeah, so right. Hello, but it's a great beginner. Could be beaten, but just come on, just give it a go. It's good. Come on, the second day would be better. I see girl if she just walks past me in this state I know. No, 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 that's uh while he's drinking. Just for a bit in the gap, look, like this. And now Oh well, who cares? I'd rather walk to pay the taxi fares. Taxi fares aren't fair at all. I need a bit of a I drink one too. I'm going to lose for the dancing floor. Barricade my door to prevent more mishaps. No talk to the girl in his lap. Ah, that's right. 
You're not lovers, it is what it is. Some lads are hers or some girls are his, so leave it, leave it, leave it. Raise your glass in the night light. Like. Feel quite right, I'm reflecting the night light. So quite like the bright type of night light. Go home, then I type on the night light. What? Oh, what? Oh, what? Yeah, what? Okay, what? Hey Meg, everyone's coming around mine on Friday. What's coming along? There'll just be music, a few splits, some drinks. Yeah, you're a friend? Fine. So, Hammond Street, um, you know the car park, we'll meet there at 6 30. Alright then, yeah, I'll catch you. Cool. <laughs> This is the girl. What do you think? I can't even tell you how many guys I've had to sleep with in the coming months. Every time I thought about telling someone, I sank back into this delusion that Charlie controlled me. That he owned me. I took so many drugs just so the reality wasn't so harsh anymore it wasn't my fault I was insecure and someone took advantage of me you know it wasn't fair that I was made to feel insignificant everything's changed now. I found help. I have so many people behind me for support. And I, I don't need drugs to take away my reality. I did it by myself. It took a while for me to realise that what was happening to me was wrong. I got bullied and it made me vulnerable and she took advantage of that. My pictures will probably be up there forever now and I can't get them back. But 
but I found the courage to tell someone what was happening to me. You know, I suppose that being a teenager automatically made me a target. I was never safe, but it's all about choices, isn't it? Why would I accept a stranger as a friend? Could be anyone. It all starts so simple. Simple hello. Click of a button. I'll never forget how Lindsay made me feel. Dirty. Useless. And ashamed. Now though, I'm, I'm proud of myself. I'm stronger and I'm more confident because I've been shown how to be careful. If it ever happens to you, please, don't blame yourself. Tell someone, your parents, the police, your school, anyone, anyone that you trust. It may seem embarrassing, but they will not judge you. You didn't do anything wrong. Just remember. You are not alone.